so I am back with some more China Rising gameplay and this is a first look at Gillen Peaks and we're playing a round of domination using the Dow 12 with frag rounds. Now this weapon actually isn't part of the China Rising DLC, it's actually one of the new weapons that features in Second Assault. So for any PlayStation 4 or PC players out there, this weapon actually won't be available in the game for quite some time. Now I'll admit I'm not usually a shotgun player, but when you're sat next to Charboy and Azzy and they're saying bring out the Dow 12 with frag rounds, it's pretty hard not to comply really. And I'll admit it was quite good fun just running around with those guys, trolling the enemy team, taking them out en masse. Now it's going to be very interesting to see when this weapon comes out with Second Assault on PC, how it's going to be put to use and see how long it takes for people to complain about getting nerfed. Now of course, being a round of domination, this is a much smaller version of the map than you will see for game modes like Conquest, Conquest Large. But as I said about Silk Road, I really do feel this map for Domination is actually one of the better maps we have so far, and it definitely works a lot better than the maps we already have in the base game of Battlefield 4. Now for me, Domination is a love-hate relationship. I think it's one of those game modes that definitely doesn't work on all maps, and it's one of those type of game modes that no matter how good a player you are, you will always get shot in the back. Players spawn at random, you can't cap them to flag, so for me it's a bit too much of a bloodbath. You can't always predict where players are going to come from, so I'm not the biggest fan of Domination. I do prefer smaller games of infantry only conquest. But with all that said, this map really does seem to play it well. You've got three main cave systems with a central area based around it. So you've got a mixture of gameplay types, you've got very dark, compact areas in the caves. And then as you step outside here, you can see you've got much lighter, open areas. So there's different areas for many different playstyles. Now, of course, it's very hard to deny that this map looks very similar to our most beloved DLC of all time. Of course, Battlefield by Company 2 Vietnam. This jungle environment with those rivers and mountains in the background does bring back a Vietnam feel and it is something very refreshing. Of course, throughout Battlefield 3, we never saw a jungle or green environment. It was all very desert or urban places. So this very lush green map is actually very refreshing. Now once again I'm going to wrap up my commentary about here and leave you guys to watch the rest of the gameplay. If you would like to see my entire review and thoughts of China Rising, that video will be out very soon. That will include some brand new gameplay of all the maps and some unseen footage of Dragon Pass. So if you would like to see that, stay tuned. And once again, if you do still want to have a chance to win yourself either some Battlefield 4 hoodies, art books or gunner glasses, all thanks to EA Games, all you have to do in the comments below is leave which one of those prizes you would like to win and leave a like on the video. And that's it. So you could get some cool stuff courtesy of EA Games. But in the meantime, guys, thank you for watching and I will see you soon.